Hi guys, this is Don. This time I have a goodness of fit problem, a chi-square goodness of fit problem for you, and we're going to do it again using StatCrunch. And the question is that we've got a national distribution of fatal in work injuries listed here in a table, percentages, and then we've got some observations in the uh, western part of the country and these are actual counts these are percentages and these are counts and the question is can you conclude at alpha of 0.1 that the distribution of fatal work injuries in the west is different from the national distribution first of all we have to identify the null and the claim the null is that the distribution in the West is the same as the national percentages. So that is our answer there, the actual percentages. You might get tripped up and put the counts in there, but academically it should be the percentages or the distribution that we're checking against. And what is the alternative is that the distribution of fatal work injuries in the West differs from the expected distribution. What is the claim? And that is the alternative, since that was the question, can we conclude that it's different? The first thing we've got to do is to calculate the chi-square critical value and the rejection region. And we're going to do that with StatCrunch. Now, we've got the little icon here, so I'm going to go ahead and open in StatCrunch and copy that data into StatCrunch. And we're going to go to Calculator, Chi-Square. Our degrees of freedom, we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 categories. So our K is 6, and our degrees of freedom is K minus 1 would be 5. Our alpha is 0.1. And remember, on our chi-squares, we're always looking at a right tail test. So this is our, our curve, and our rejection area is in red, and that is to the right or greater than... 9.236 okay I'm gonna just close that and get that out of the way and the next thing we need to do though is to go ahead and convert these uh, percentages into a expected count and I'm gonna do that using the computer in StatCrunch I'm going to click on build the expression and we're going to multiply the national percentage I'm going to double click on that times the total number and I think that is 6231 and we need to divide this by 100 because we want to convert those percentages into a decimal and I'm going to click OK, and I'm going to label this column Expected. So, now we've got our observed counts and our expected counts, and all we have to do is go to Goodness of Fit, Chi-Square Tests. Our observed is the Western Frequency. Our expected is Expected. We're just going to click on Compute, and we've got the results of our test. We've got our chi-square statistic, 57.5, and we've got a p-value of very, very small. So that tells us that the test is significant and that we should reject the null hypothesis. But let's go ahead and look and see what they came up here in my stat lab, there's our 57.511, and we are going to reject the null at the 10%. There is enough evidence to conclude that the distribution 
differs from the national distribution. Hope this helps.